What's good everybody, it's your boy TJ and today I'm going to answer one of our most frequently asked questions like ever and it's um, how to stay motivated to go to the gym and um, all I've got to say is YouTube CT Fletcher like that's it, you can cut off the video now I'm messing with you um, First things first, I'd say you need to set yourself a goal like a goal is probably the first thing you need to do to set yourself um, purely because once you have a goal and you're working towards something you're going to definitely work harder like if you don't have any goal, then you won't work as hard because you just think, huh, well I can skip gym today, there's no problem. If you think of say if you're walking down a tunnel, if you see a light at the end of the tunnel, you know what you're walking towards, you know what you're going to get close to. Every step by step, you're getting close to the end of that light so you can get out of the tunnel. If it's like pitch black and you have no idea like what you're going towards, what you're moving towards, you're just going to stop eventually. Whereas when you see that light at the end of the tunnel, you're going to stay motivated, right? And that's the best probably analogy I can think of to like apply to this purely because it just makes so much sense. Once you have yourself a goal in place and you know that every time you go to the gym you're getting one step towards the end of that light of that tunnel, you're gonna feel better. And another way to like consistently help with that is take progress pictures and like that's probably one of the second thing we need to do. Take progress pictures so you can see improvement. Once you see improvement in yourself, it motivates you to keep going even more. Like when me and Rizzy first started, we took one every single two weeks in picture and in video. And it keeps you motivated because when you see yourself like getting better over the weeks, like, oh yeah, I'm actually starting to feel stronger or my physique's looking better. It makes you think, oh, okay, I like that. It makes you feel like you, you earn something so you keep going to the gym. Whereas if you wasn't getting stronger and you didn't look any better, you start to think, huh, well, I can't be asked to go if I'm getting no improvements. So that's what you need to do, take your progress pictures and obviously they also let you know if what you're doing is working. If it's working, you'll try harder, won't you? And that's the best way to think of to do it. And yeah, I don't want to make this video too long, but I just want to say that you definitely need to set yourself a goal because there's no point sitting at home, um, looking at all these pictures of people on Instagram like Lazar Angelov and going, oh, I want that physique. Then you do nothing towards getting it at the end of the day. If, that's, if you want that physique, make that your goal physique. And every time you go to the gym, think of it that you're you're benching or you're crunching or you're squatting your way closer towards that dream and once you get that physique you can just be like you can sit up in your house and be like bitch I made it you know what I mean that's what you can literally do one day just think, imagine yourself doing that one day you're sitting there saying bitch I made it and just looking all ripped up and shit or whatever your goal is there is different things that motivate different people for example for me I'd say if we didn't this YouTube channel is definitely motivating for me probably if we didn't have this YouTube channel and I support all these videos I know for a fact I wouldn't be as motivated as I am. I'm saying that's not the thing for me personally that helps me stay motivated to go in the gym. But most of all, I will still say having myself a goal physique that I want to go towards. One day I would love to like that's our Angela. And every time I go to the gym, that's my that's me making that step closer, 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 trying to get to the end of the light that tunnel. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, I don't want to make the video too long as I said, so that's basically it. And if anything, if I have more thoughts or insights on this that I want to share about my different motivation that keep me in the gym, I'll just do like a part two, part three, etc, etc, etc. Because there's, there's so many things you can talk about about motivation, which is why on YouTube, if you type in gym motivation, there's billions and billions of videos. Because anyway, there's so much different things you can talk about. So the next time I have anything else I think may motivate someone else out there, I'll, I'll make sure to do a part two and I'll put it up on the channel for you guys. But yeah man, like, comment, subscribe, and we out. So somebody better cut me a check. Yeah. Name your top rap, I'll be after his neck. Uh. I just want the money, nigga, and the respect. Uh. Niggas say they